Hello and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be making lingering potions using up all this experience down here and a whole bunch of other stuff you know. So yeah, so I thought after I uh, killed the dragon and I got all these um, dragons breath I'd, I'd make a few lingering potions but so yeah, so yeah, let's just do it. But first let's get rid of some of these levels, uh, lapis, books and stuff, let's, let's see if it, oh, can't enchant cobble, what am I doing? Fire Oh, that's pretty good. I might. Two. Oh, does it go up to three? I can't remember. I'll gra oh, grab the wrong one. Aqua Affinity, though. That's pretty good. I could add that to my helmet. So, yeah, let's check again. Um, Power four. Yeah. Flame one. Okay, so, um, yeah. Let me uh start by uh, making a bunch more bottles for the lingering potions. Yeah, I'm sort of like. Disjointed, is that, yeah, is that the right word? Yeah, sort of disjointed. It's, yeah, that's the right word. I'm trying, I'm trying to think of words. But yeah, I'm sort of like... Um, oops. So yeah, I'm sort of, um... Pa not panicky, I don't know why I'm panicky. But yeah, so I'm just doing a bunch of random stuff. Right now. That's water bottle. Water in all these. And then I'm going to make some awkward potions, because I'm going to make some very interesting splash potions. Not splash potions, I'm lingering potions. Alright, I need never warts. I'm making some poison potions to be lingering. So I think that's a pretty good potion to make. Uh, awkward. Make these awkward. Make Oh, not cobblestone. Another awkward one. But yeah. Awkward, I'm very <laughs> awkward. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Hmm, where is it? Here, mob drops, spider eyes. I'll just grab those. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm just running around. Out. They're all awkward. So now I add in one, two, Three. There we go. That should take a little bit. I should make some more uh, more stuff to enchant. Like, let's have a look. I'll make another pick, just for it. Um, and and silk touch. If it, only thing I'm going to enchant with it, silk touch. I could use another sword with um unbreaking. I need unbreaking stuff. Um, what do I need? I don't, um, another axe. So I only got unbreaking on that. Another axe? No, nah, not another axe. Um, trying to think what, what else do I need. What else do I make? I could make a shovel. No, nah, I'll save my diamonds. Um, I'll create like. No, nah, I won't create anything else. Just another pick for the um the silk touch. So yeah, if I if I only if I see silk touch, I'll enchant that. So let's grab a cordle in my inventory. Let's go. Efficiency 4, no, I only want Silk Touch for that. Flame 1. Power, I only want Infinity on the bow as well, so... I'll even do a level 1 enchant. Uh, efficiency 4. Power 3, even worse. And Protection 3. Ooh, Prop 3, that's really good, actually. Efficiency 4. Power 4. Blast 4. Um, oh, power 1. Oh, I, love, I love having all these levels, man. It's so much fun. Uh, no. I'm breaking. No. Sweeping edge. Could be useful. Power three. I already have sweeping edge three, so... Do we do a level one? No, I'll do, I'll do sweeping edge three. Um, yeah. Always nice to have. I'm breaking. No. Can't enchant spider eyes. Power four. No. Sharpness four. Nice. Sweeping edge again. Let me just put these books away that are clogging my inventory. Do -do -do. Yep, I need to like sort them out, like like good, like good, good, good enchants versus the bad ones. But yeah, this is fun. Let's get the lingering potions made now. Do -do -do. So yeah, I'm just doing like all this random stuff because like you know you sort of have to do it now. So I got poison potions. Then if I add in the uh, 
Dragon's Breath. Is it is it now or when they're splash? I'll try it. I'll try it. I think it's either now or when they're splash. I'll try it. No, you have to be splash. Okay, so I need some gunpowder. Got a lot of gunpowder, which is not which is nice. Nice. Ow. Two. One. Two. Uh, three. Well, should I make them poison two, actually? Let's grab the, uh, gunpowder. I think it's, uh, redstone to make it more powerful, and then... Um, glowstone to make it, um, longer. Is it glowstone to make it longer, or is it glowstone to make it more powerful? I'll just have to see. Um... So yeah, I don't, I don't know. I can't remember. But if it makes it longer, then... Oh, uh, yeah, that's good. Back to enchanting. Let's go. Sweeping edge. Infinity. Yes, there we go. Oh, that's a pretty nice bow. If I find any flame, flame books, I'll... Yeah. Th um, This makes it longer, which I probably want for... Lingering potions, but do I have any glowstone? Or oh, a whole stack? That's good. So the next next lot of potions I'll make um with glowstone. Um, let's add in one. Wait, they're not splash yet. Almost forgot they have to be splash. The um. Never the the thing's running out. I better grab more. What's it called? More blaze powder soon. I'm running low. I'm I like I like how they changed it where you need blaze powder to like power the the thing up. I think that's a really cool like um addition. I think it's re I think it is. I think it's really cool. Now in one two free to make my very first lingering potions. I haven't actually done this stuff in survival, like. But now I've got an infinity bow. Ooh. Weird. Okay, now I've got an infinity bow. This one can... But it's power 5. How much is it to, like, combine them? 13 levels. Okay, when I finish, I could add them together. So, so, wait, what does it create? I just want to just check. Power 5, Breaking, and Fit. That's the perfect bow right there. Or do I keep them separate and keep them like... Like... I don't know. I'll, you know, I'll combine them. I'll combine them. But there's my first Lingering Potions. Look, 22 seconds. 22. 22 seconds. Now, if I had arrows, which I... Wait. Yeah, I don't. If I did, though, I could create tips arrows. So I learned how to do that. Oh, wait, let me just, like, create my... F I haven't actually done this and, um... You do this. Wait, no. For... Uh, no. For uh, a glowing arrow, you do that. A. But I don't think Infinity works with tips arrows, so... Yeah. Let's grab these and start work on the the next ones. It's really cool though. I I um I might throw one just to like have a look. You know I'm gonna throw one. Ready? Look at that. I'm gonna walk in it just at twenty seconds. If I stand in it, it's state. Wow. It's really cool. I love the green potions. It's pretty cool, man. Okay. Now to do some more enchanting. Uh, efficiency free. Heck no. Fire protection. Uh, might get something else. No, it didn't. Efficiency four. No, only um silk touch. Luck of the sea free. Oh, that, that reminds me. We should make a fishing rod as well. Enchant that. And the only reason I'm like doing this is because I'm scared. I don't want to like carry so many uh. What's the word? I can't carry as many levels on me. Because okay, if I die and like lose the levels, I'm going to be like so like... Uh... 
Yeah. What? Another three? Oh, that's a bow. Oh, I actually really like the uh the thing. I don't. I, I like remembering it though, because it's like I feel like more like awesome when I remember it. But yeah, and uh, fishing rod, lapis, law two, silk. A hey, silk touch. That's what I wanted. I didn't want anything else. Book. Looting too. I actually need more looting for my my sword. I'm breaking. You know what? I might go for that. Law 3. I need more lapis. My inventory is still clogged full of potions. Let me just get rid of all these splash poisons of lingering. Do, do, do. Where is it? In here. Grab a stack. There we go. Ow. Okay. Put a stack in. Law 3. Now I have Law 3 and uh, Luck of the Sea 3, which I can literally just put on a fishing rod with um, Breaking 3. There. Yep. Yeah, literally perfect. Bean of Arthropods. Feather Falling 1. I could get that up. Smite. Feather Falling 2. Yep. Yeah. Oh, my past level level thing. Oh, wow, I'm out of levels. Nice. Now we go to the good old anvil. This is going to die soon. I need to make a new one. Create this, the ultimate bow. Bam. Now I have a god bow, plus a fishing rod, plus a lure free. Plus that. Seven levels. I don't have seven levels. Oh, well. I used all my levels, but it was worth it. So now if I go back down here, and I put the lapis away, this and this need to be combined, so I'll leave that there. Do -do -do. And yeah, now if I, where is it, here, this one, throw these in here, do -do -do. all that in there. And there, yeah, so this episode, this, this episode was all about, like, just... Doing that that sort of stuff like don't know why I have fire resistance to do. I'll keep these on me in case. I'll bring one of those as well. They're always nice. Da -da -da. But yeah, so this episode was just like about doing like fun stuff and all that sort of jazz. Because I'm gonna head to the. Uh, but what's it called? The end city soon. I'm gonna do that. That's gonna be fun. I can't wait to. I can't wait to go. I can't wait to go. I'm so excited. Oh yeah, that's my efficiency five pick I made earlier, and I could put this one away. This other fortune three, and oh, why I made the silk touch pickaxe was for this. So if I have any obsidian, which I do, that's an that's actually a perfect amount. And if I grab the last blaze rod, and I come over here. And I make a Eye of Ender. And I make you the Ender Chest. When you usually pick up an Ender Chest with a Diamond Pick, it breaks. But if you have Silk Touch, it shouldn't drop any of the... Uh, don't have any, I don't have any efficiency. Do I have any efficiency in here? Uh, efficiency 4, 4, 4, 1, 1, 1. Do have any efficiency four? Come on. Apparently I don't. But yeah, so I have this. So I have one here. If I actually grab this one as well. So I need to put this near my stuff downstairs. Now I have infinite, like, sort of, you know, stuff. So now, like, here. I carry one of my inventory. Whenever I find something in the, the end city, like, let's say I need... And I break like a fortune free. It's in there. I need some iron. It's in there. To make some iron stuff. Ha like I'll just half the diamonds. Look. Look there. So now I have like extra inventory. 
And then you can find that with sh shulker shells, like, that are in there. Then you have, like, infinite inventory. It's really, really cool. Look, so if I grab some cobblestone, I grab, like, a couple stacks on me. Yeah. Look at this. There you go. Just a bunch of stuff I might need. I could put some... I'll put some, um... What's it called in there? Some, uh... What's the word? Potions, 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 potions. Grab night vision, fire resistance, water breathing. I don't need that in the uh, the thing. Couple potions of lingering po po um, poison. Just throw them all in there. Fire res, night vision, one of the strengths. And yeah, the axe, I'll throw that in there. And there you go. Now I have like... Basically, oh wait, so like if I go over here, I'm like, oh, I need my stuff over there, place this down. It's all there. That's why I, I think it's a really cool idea. It's like it's like a backpack, really. And an ender chest is literally a backpack. And then a, shulk, a shulker box, a shulker box is actually a backpack. Whereas an ender chest is like a portable chest, which is really cool. Like, it's not used enough. I don't think people enough people do that. So now I'm going to go um, kill some skeletons, you know, just... Casually go kill a whole bunch of those guys. So I can make some tips arrows. And it's also fun to kill. Kill uh, random mobs. But yeah. Oh, and if I get seven levels, I can chant, I can combine the, the fishing rod. Oh, I need to put some lever in the, uh, lever in the, uh, chest. Because they're an anvil. Because then I can fix my light drove. I have enough. Let me just... Gosh dang, I'm gonna keep it in. Hey, hey! Oh, no, there's a creeper. Try to run. Run away. Look at that, he's glowing! That's so cool, I love... I need to practice with shields. Like, a lot of the 1.9 stuff, I just, like, didn't practice with, like. Like, I didn't do, like, I haven't done lingering potions and stuff like that. Oh, dang it. I haven't practiced, like, the timing on, like, the, uh, what's it called? The, uh, the shield, like, like that. I keep getting hit. And I have the shield up. Oh, dang it. Okay. There you go. And you block. You hit. Block. Hit. Ah. Almost got the timing down. Block. Hit. Block. There you go. Do I have enough for a, uh, I'm, I just need, like, a little bit more. Where is it? There's two more skeletons over there. Do do, -do. How do. How do, like, YouTubers actually commentate when they're, like, mid, like, doing stuff? Like, like when you're, like, really concentrating. Like, I, I can't do it. It's hard. Three. Oh, nice. Redstone. Glowstone. That's actually an infinite source of, like, redstone. Which is... Block. I'm already level 10, man. Just killing stuff. That's pretty good. Grab some more arrows. Do I have enough? Nine. There we go. Perfect amount. I'll kill one more skeleton. So I, no, I won't. I'll just go straight back. And I'll show you how to make a uh, lingering potion of lingering. Let's go. My goodness. All the cows are escaping. I don't really care. I love when, I love when like you're like super end game and you're just like making like massive auto farms. That's like pretty 
pretty cool. Like, I don't know. What do you guys think? Like, is there a point when, like, Minecraft, like, Endgame gets, like, two Endgame? It's like, oh, wow. I fell. Uh, but yeah, like, I, I like, I like the Endgame. Like, I love having, like, loads of diamonds, like, ten stacks, you're, like, you're, like, balling, you're, like, you know? You know, when you're having loads of fun, it's great. So I grab one, I'll grab point one from down here. I just don't know why I don't have more. Grab another lingering potion. Whoop. And you get your lingering potion, you put it in the middle, surround it with arrows, and you get tipped arrows. I have never created tipped arrows in survival before. So I think it uses the tipped arrow first. If you put it the other way, like that. Yeah, it does. So if you put the arrow the uh, in the first slot, it'll use up the uh, tipped arrow. But if you put it in like that order, it'll use up the, the normal arrow, the infinity arrow. So there you go. So if I want to go poison, I'll switch them around. That's a quick tip there. So I have the levels for the thing. I also need to make something that's very important. And that is fireworks. So I can actually fly. You can actually fly in Minecraft. You actually can't. I can't even believe that you can actually fly. That, that, that's mind blowing to me. I have the perfect fishing rod as well. I'll put this in uh, the uh, the chest. Honestly, you're not. I should just put them in the the inner chest. But now I'll put them in here in this chest. I don't mind. But yeah, I need paper and gunpowder. So fifty gunpowder. I should have paper in here. Wait, no, it's in there. Yes. But yeah. So yeah, the, the whole point about about ugh, stuff is you can fly. I can't. It's like it's like sort of mind blowing that you can fly in Minecraft. Like you get the uh, what's the word? The firework with the with elytra, and you go, pew, and you fly. Like it's it, it's like infinite flight basically, literally is infinite flight. So you just get paper. Where's the paper? Up. Oh, didn't didn't change it to paper. Drag it across. That's more than enough paper. And I believe you just any combo you want. Almost three stacks. Almost three stacks of paper. Not paper. Oh, uh, fireworks. I I don't know. I'm just like going a bit crazy. But paper would go in here. But yeah, so now I have almost got. What's it called? So yeah, I'd, I'd put the uh, fireworks, like, I'll put like two stacks in there. And then I'll like put you and you there. Like that. And then you go, like, as you, like, fly, you, like, pop the uh, firework. I'll show you when I, like, get the elytra in the thing. But let me just, like, use one. Hey! Fireworks. So that's what you're supposed to use them for, but you can use them to fly. Which I think is really cool. And if you also have a punch bow, you can also fly. But I, I'm, not, I'm not that skilled to, like, be, like... But, yeah. So, yeah. Thank you for watching this episode. A lot of important stuff I had to do. Oh, I filled out the farms and stuff a bit more. I, filled, I finished um that, if you ha hadn't seen the um the greenhouse and stuff. Look at that squid. I can't wait for fish to be added. It's going to be so cool. Because I haven't touched these snapshots. I don't like going on snapshots. I like waiting for the actual release. Like, when fish are in the water, I'm going to be, like, freaking out. It's going to add so much. I'm, like, really hyped. Like, imagine that, like, full of, like, seaweed and stuff. And then fish. It's going to look so nice. I can't wait. Can't wait. Rivers and stuff. I hope rivers and stuff look really cool. But yeah. Thank you for watching. I'm hyped for 1.13. I'm going to go fight entities tomorrow. I'm like. I actually have never. Actually had. A, actually gone and explored one. In survival. At all. So this is going to be. Like my first time really doing it. Because it's like such an end game thing. That I've never done it. But yeah. So I'm going to leave off and I'll 
meet you at the um, end, and um, goodbye.